Hello everybody, welcome to Elite Wine TV. I'm Hello everybody, welcome to Elite Wine TV. Hello everybody, welcome to Elite Wine TV. I'm your host, Mark Fusco, here for another episode of the show. All right, we've got the last of the Finca El Origin series of wines. Um, finishing off with their Gran Reserva, which of course I didn't do what I was supposed to do to look stuff up. Anyway, this is the 2008 um, uh, Gran Reserva Malbec. Uh, this is also coming from the Valley de Uco uh, in Mendoza. And um, 2008. So um, one thing significant about this bottle is heavy, dude. It's like it's thick. It's heavy. Um, get a little close up of the of the label there. Um, now on their website, they didn't have a fact sheet for this, but um, they only had 2009, 2010. But it's not. I'm going to gather it's still not 100% Malbec. Um, this runs average price $21 right now. Um, all vintages, not just in 2008. Um, so $20 bottle of wine-ish. So, um, but uh, as far as the varietals in here, 2010's got Malbec, Cab, Sauv, and Bonarda. And then the uh, 2009, it had, uh, I think, just Cab and Malbec. Malbec and Cab. So no Bernard. I don't know what the 2008 has. But um, same area as their regular Malbec or the Reserve of Malbec. Uh, this is just uh, going to be a higher quality uh, grapes. And um, they also aged this. Well, at least the 2009 was 13 months. Let's see about the 2010. See what it says. Uh, fact sheet 2010. No. Uh, it doesn't say in the 2010, even though I'm pulling up the fact sheet. I keep getting the 2009 fact sheet. So let's just assume it's, it's twice as long uh, as far as aging in French oak. All right. Nice, nice dark color here. Smells like a richer wine. I'm really getting that darker cherry, blackberry, I'm going to guess cassis, almost like a pie aspect to it. I'm really getting that type of fruit stuff. Not, too, not so much on the floral end. Um, Getting a bit of spice, like some of the peppers and just other spices. And it's it's more of a subtle nose. It doesn't really like just come out and attack you. Nice full tannins, um, kind of silky, really coats the mouth, very smooth. Um, I'm getting kind of the, I'm getting that, again, the, the blackberry, dark, yeah, more the blackberry, even raspberry type of, of fruits with a little bit of creaminess like vanilla that's coming from the, from the oak. Not so much, so maybe a hint of pepper. The woods there, um, you know, like being out in the country, but it doesn't doesn't linger very long. 
this is a very silky wine, very smooth, um, not very, uh, and it's not very hot. I mean, it's a 14.8 alcohol, and I'm getting a little bit of heat on the back end. I mean, that's why I had it look like, what type of alcohol was it? Um, I want to check out the alcohol, the rest of these. Let me see other Malbec, what it was. I don't see it anywhere. It's got to be out here somewhere. Do, 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 do. But I mean, this is just, this is really very, very nice and smooth. Um, huh, interesting. But uh, uh, like I said, just a hint of it at the very end, but nothing, nothing too bad. Oh, Christian, can't, hey, I got another viewer. Uh, hold on. Christian, yes, you can. You have to get the Justin TV iPad app. But um, really, really nice. I mean, I, and I have the I have the actual Argentinian bottle. Um, one because it's got uh, oh here's the alcohol right there, fourteen and a half on that. Because when it has the uh, on, on the back, it's all in Spanish. So it's like I was actually I bought it from there. So the entire back's in Spanish. Um, it's used it uses European numbering system instead of decimals using using commas so it's um it's a uh, it's like the I mean, not that not that the others aren't the real deal but this is the exact model if i was in argentina where i'd buy rather than this is you know all the other ones were the american you know the imports so um anyway real quick i'm going to type this in get the justin tv app but I'm almost done. So anyway, um, really good. If you can find this, buy it. Twenty bucks, definitely worth it. I think it stands up to anything that's out there uh, that's more than twenty dollars. I feel like I want to drink this wine tonight. Not that the others aren't good, but it's like, I really want to drink this. I get it a 92. I think it's um, excellent wine. Really good. Another food wine, though. Um, I didn't really wouldn't want to just drink this on its own, but I could. It really should be paired with some food. So, really nice. Really, really, really nice wine. Highly recommend it. All right, well, that's going to do it for today um, and for this show. Uh, as always, uh, click the links below as far as the website. I'll have a link for that. Uh, click the links above to friend me up. Um, and then over there, PayPal donate button. And um, that's going to do it. We'll see everyone again next time.